We got the Hornets versus Pacers. This is going to be my first Hornets reaction and Pacers of the year, I think. So, we're going to check it out. But we're going to see what these two niggas hitting on, bro. What they going off, bro. Because I remember last year, what's it called? Melo ain't make the all-star team, but Halliburton did. Because he was averaging like 22 and 10 rebounds, bro. We're going to see, though. Melo and Halliburton, bro, they like. They be going neck and neck, bro, type shit. And both of them just got, like, 260 million fucking extensions, bro, from the rookie year. So, this shit gonna be hype, bro. Number three pick versus number five. I think Melo went third and Halliburton went, like, five or six, one of those. I think five. Oh, shit. They got OV and Indy. Okay, okay. I like that. I ain't gonna lie. Because y'all know Obi was in that same draft class. They picked him up at like, like seven. Damn, they got Obi on the paces. Okay, I like that. He going he to go off, bro. Oh, Hornets still got this nigga Terry Rozier, but I thought they would have packed him up by now. Okay, this calm. They still got my man Kyle Jones, though. What happens to Kyle Jones, bro? <laughs> nah, ain't no way they really got rid of that nigga Kyle, bro. It has to be fake, bro. I don't believe it. They still got Gordon Hayward. I be forgetting. Like, the Hornets look, he got a cool little squad. But they don't be able to. Oh, they got, um, what's his name? Something, uh, I forgot that dude's name, bro. On the Pacers. Benedict McMack McCaffrey, something like that. Benedict something. I heard he was nice. He just came off his rookie season. He was cooking. That's what I heard. Through the grape, grapevine, though. Good pass. Okay. What are you finna do? Throw it up, throw it up. I seen the vision. That was a shitty pass, though, but Obi was able to finish that. Look, look, look at that pass. That was a trash pass, bro. Like, what are you doing? Look at that. That shit was garbage, bro. It was all the way back. It was supposed to be, you feel me? He had to extend all the way, bro. But he made it work, though. Mello. Okay. Just think of Melo, bro, with the passes be so elite, bro. Damn, Miles Bridges was supposed to come back this season, bro. This nigga Miles Bridges, bro. Had to go fuck up his situation, bro. Who that? Nigga look big as hell. Benedict. Ain't no way. Ah, he wanted to post it, that nigga. Wanted to put him on the t shirt. Good boy. Top of the key knockdown. Nah, he. Okay, he said, let me dry that motherfucker. Gotta be tough being an NBA player, but when they going for lifts, they gotta make sure or floaters, they gotta make sure that shit high as hell. Have a high ass arc, bro. Cause all these NBA players could damn near jump and touch the top of the rim, bro. So whatever lip you're going for, that shit has to be high as fuck so you don't get blocked. Little give and go action. Man. That's deep. I know he had that in his bag. Tween. Get him on tween behind the back. What you finna do? Ooh, has he? Okay. That's what you call good footwork, bro. Good post work. Ooh. I thought he was finna pull that shit. Bro, got me too. I ain't gonna lie. This nigga been playmaking like crazy, though. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna front. Terry Rozier All the way to the rim That was a tough layup to make in the line. I hope y'all niggas didn't hear that shit bro My tummy was just fucking growling for dear life Nah that's nice One point game They don't count it? Okay but he made the free throws though 
I don't know. Did he? Because it was, I don't know. I don't know what just happened on that play. I feel so stupid, bro. Like, I remember the 2020 draft, bro. I wasn't fucking with this nigga Tyrese Halliburton, bro. I didn't see the potential, bro. I had no hope, faith in, bro. Like, not, like at all, bro. His first year, he averaged like 13.7 assists, some, some valid stats, little stat line like that. But I'm like, bro, I don't, I don't think he's going to be here too long, bro. I thought he was going to be out after his second year, bro. But, bro, proved everybody wrong, bro. Like, that must be, bro. I feel so dumb. 25 in the third quarter is wild. From deep. Let's step back. All right. Fader. Okay, get shot. Oh, they got Brandon Miller, bro. I forgot about this nigga. Is he that he just he just got in the game? Was it was that Miller that blocked it? I think he just got in the game. They're not giving Miller no clock. Oh, he missed that shot. Miles Turner, I forget they got him. School threat alert, school threat alert, school threat alert. Bro's trying to crash out, bro, on a rookie, bro. You trying to crash out on your first, on your 10-day contract? It's crazy. <laughs> Look at this nigga's face, though. Look at his face right here, bro. This nigga's funny. It's funny, man. Bro's going to get checked out the ass, bro. Like, you don't even get paid nothing yet, and you trying to crash out, bro. Like, these niggas get me tight when they do that dumb shit, bro. When they find you, the league gonna find you out the ass, bro. They not even, they not gonna spare that nigga, bro. It's clear for him. He probably got packed out the game too. Oh, he ain't get packed out. He's still in there. From deep, kind of range this dude got, bro. That nigga strap, no dyke. Ain't no way back to back. I was about to say, if Melo hit that, it would have been. It still counts though. It still made that. I don't know how bro got it, but he got it. Three point game, Pacers. Looking to make it a one point game and a foul. You gotta make the free throw. You gotta make the free throw. They got Buddy Hill. That's Buddy Hill. Okay, he he Buddy Hill missed the free throw. That's what it looking like. Twenty seconds. Oh shit, that's a twenty IQ. They hit it off PJ. Okay. Bro, what are you doing? You got Reggie Bush on the screen. Are you fucking kidding me, bro? Hornets is a one point, uh, one point game. How do I get this nigga off, bro? I'm so pissed that this shit is blocking the actual game. We got Hornets 125 to um, Pacers 124. Two seconds left. House of highlights, bro. Do better, bro. Like I can't even see the shit. Wait, is it? Wait, he got the steal? No way. Wait, let me see. I'm trying to see, bro. You know what, bro? We're going to have to come out of this. Go to, like, let me see. House of Highlights. I think they're going to have it. Have, like, a clip of the last second of that motherfucker. Oh, my gosh. My tummy is literally rumbling right now. I don't know if y'all can. I hope y'all didn't hear that, bro. Please, bro. Please, bro. If y'all heard it, just act like y'all didn't hear nothing. Please, bro. Okay, right here. Lamelo Lock, so fuck how side likes for this shit, bro. That shit pissed me off. Like, how can y'all niggas like? I mean, nah, I'm tweaking. What I say, fuck. It's not even them that be putting it up. It's YouTube that automatically like recommends some shit after, right? All right, let's go to it. This says Lamelo locks up Tyrese Halliburton and wins the game. This man Melo always been known for playing 0, 0.00 defense, but like they say, he locked him up for the game winner. Let's see though. You got 10 seconds left, Halliburton. Down by down by one, not to force nothing. Six seconds, five seconds. Oh nah! Tsh, damn. Nah, that is nigga Melo. He kicked the ball. Is crazy. 
I'm surprised they ain't got like a, a kickball violation or something. Look, look, let me see. Look at the time. Oh, it's already zero zero. Bro, kick the ball. <laughs> nah, that was calm. That was calm. I ain't gonna lie. I don't know what he's chatting about right now, though. But like, <laughs> okay. Oh, shit, he talking shit? Nah, he wildin'. He talking shit? I thought it was cool. Holy, there's beef? They got beef in this motherfucker? Should've just chucked that hoe up. I ain't gonna lie. Oh, nah, he looked back and was talking shit? Oh, nah, good hands, though. I ain't gonna lie. That's good hands right there. No foul. Clean. I'm trying to see what he's saying, but I don't know what he's saying, bro. That's calm. Let's look at that box score, though. We got Hornets. What is it? Yeah, Hornets versus Pacers. Hornets versus Pacers, and it's out. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. Alright, box score. Well, let's see the Hornets. PJ Washington with 15 points. That's that's calm. Melo will let, yeah, that's what I told you. He ain't had no buckets, bro. He had 11 points, but 11 assists. Because I've seen him playmaking like crazy. He ain't even attempt no shots, bro. Mark Williams, yeah, this is the nigga he was, bro, that got, got him out of them damn assists at 27. Brandon Miller with 10 points. Gordon Hayward with 23. Terry was 22. Okay, okay, that's calm. Calm stat line right there from the team. And let's see the Pacers, though. Who went crazy? Oh, nah. Halliburton had 43 points and 12 assists. Now, he had him a great game. He just sold in the last, bro, and the most important, bro. The most important part, bro, bro, sold the game. That's kind of crazy. I ain't going to lie. 43 to fucking turn over the game winner, bro. <sighs> Man, that's tough. But he healed with nine, 19 points, calm. Uh, who else? Miles Turner with 14. OB Toppin with 11. Okay, but they gave him 25. You got to give him at least 30 minutes, bro. Got to give my man Obi some clock, bro. Let him cook. Let him cook, bro. But yeah, though, it is what it is. Y'all let me know, bro. Is the Hornets like that, bro? Is Melo like that, bro? Or was this just like a, a fluke bro? or some shit like that, if that's the right word? But yeah, though, stay safe, stay positive, stay out the way. Catch on the next one.